poaching eggs. First thing you're going to need is a pan of boiling water, but the water only needs to be on a, what's known as a rolling boil. So it's not fierce, the bubbles are coming up fairly slowly. If it's too fast, just turn the heat down a little bit. You'll need a cup and a knife to crack the eggs into the cup. So we'll use the cup to put the eggs into the pan. You'll need your plate that you're going to serve your eggs on and you'll need a slotted spoon. I'm also going to use some vinegar and that I'm going to put that into the boiling water that will help keep the egg white nice and tight around the egg yolk. So you only need a little bit of a splash so I'm just going to put a splash of vinegar in there. I'm just going to give that a little swirl to make sure the vinegar is mixed into the water. And I'm going to take my egg using a knife, I'm just going to hold it in the palm of my hand and I'm going to give it one sharp tap. And I'm going to put the egg using my thumbs into the where I've cracked the egg. Just pop it into the egg, the egg into the cup. This will help when you're putting it into the pan. So you're not cracking the egg straight into the pan. Then what I'm going to do, I'm going to swirl the water very carefully so I don't splash the water out the sides of the pan. I'm just going to start so it swirls around and then I'm going to carefully lower in the egg. gently going to just keep the water moving just pushing the water around in a circle very gently you don't want to touch the egg with a spoon and that will help keep the egg rolling around the pan so it doesn't stick to the bottom of the pan again if you think it's boiling too much just turn the gas down That the water's just simmering. And I'm just going to swirl it nice and gently. This will take a minute or two. If there's any white scum comes to the top, then all you can do is just move it out of your pan. Just skim it off. This doesn't take too long. Swirl it around a little bit more and then use the slotted spoon carefully. Lift the egg out. Switch the gas off. And you can see the water draining from underneath the egg. This is a very runny egg. So obviously if you want it cooked so the yolk is harder then it has to stay in a little bit longer. Take your plate, make sure the water's drained off, then carefully pop your poached egg on the plate. And there you have a nice runny dippy egg.